Amy on location today in Round Top, Texas. Round Top boasts a burgeoning population of 90 people, but twice a year they have an antique show that draws thousands and thousands of people to this little town. The antique show itself actually goes on for miles. I'm gonna take a look around and see what we can find. Our first stop was Marburger Farm Antique Show, which featured 350 vendors, but you did have to pay to get in. It was $10 per adult, but it was set up a lot like a junior league show, and the vendors were well worth it. There was a lot of quality merchandise and really quite a lot to look at. Our next stop was the Cole Antique Show, which was a mile and a half west of the Marburger Farm. This show was free entry and also featured quite a few vendors, but these vendors were all over the spectrum from metalwork to pottery to old books, so it was almost more like a flea market in how you walk from vendor to vendor as opposed to big open tents that were shared by multiple vendors. Lastly, we ended at the town of Round Top. There were vendors in every nook and cranny that you could find on the street fronts and in the parking lots, in the green open spaces, and every storefront was wide open. There's so much to see and do around Round Top during the antique show. The antique show actually happens twice a year in April and in September, so make sure you check out their website to find the next time that you can come visit. If you're looking for something specific or just want to look around or just need to get out of the woodlands and enjoy the beautiful landscape of Texas, the drive to Round Top should definitely be on your list.